Well, the victims' talks were um, obviously, uh, were, sorry, were clearly relieved uh, by this verdict. They didn't expect much, but they got more that, than uh, they expected. Um, a six-month suspended sentence uh, might, seem, uh, might seem minor, but it's not for them. It's highly symbolic. There was a lot of emotion in uh, the courtroom today. Uh, I can tell you that when the judge pronounced the words, we find... Cardinal Barbarin guilty, uh, you know, people's breath were, were suspended as well, and there were tears, uh, tears of joy at uh, the exit of the, the courtroom. So for them, it is a victory um, that they've been fighting for for the past three years, and it goes beyond um, the, the borders of France. They have uh, spoken out to the world through, you know, all the media coverage they have had and a lot of support. Well, oh, Valerie, this uh, verdict, of course, means that uh, Cardinal Barbara won't actually be serving any time behind bars. But what message does this send out, you know, given that this comes just a week after the Vatican held that very high-profile summit aimed at tackling child sex abuse? Well, it does send a message. It's a suspended sentence, but it's the longest one uh, that was actually uh, um, given against uh, a bishop in France. There were cases before. There were two cases, two bishops who were convicted uh, uh, on the same grounds for the same uh, reasons, but they got... Um, s you know, um, shorter uh, suspended sentences. So it's a highly symbolic verdict. And indeed, as you say, talks, it comes a week after the, the um, Rome Special Summit on Sexual Abuse, which has been uh, seen as uh, um, an important step forward, even though Pope Francis came short of uh, enacting a zero-tolerance canon law, and this is what uh, associations of victims throughout the world are expecting. And Valerie, what about the fate of the priest at the centre of these allegations, Father Prena? Yes, well, Father Prena is the next step in this uh, French, um, you know, um, sexual abuse victims uh, fight. Uh, the trial is expected by the end of the year. The date has not been set yet. And uh, the defense lawyers today have been saying that all the focus has been put on Barbarin, but the real culprit in their eyes is Father Prena, who is likely to face uh, more trouble.